Jeffrey's graduation uh, was yesterday. And I... Let me tell you something. I went to my baby's graduation. I don't have many pictures because I cried my lashes off the whole time. That... When I... <laughs> And, and it was it, chomping on that daggone gum. I was sitting, <laughs> that boy, and I, you know, and I was sitting there and I was trying to like communicate with my eyes, take the gum out your mouth, which made him chomp on it more. But it, you know, it was, I gotta just take my head off to, to this, being a single mom, we were late and rushing. He was at school. I'm trying to get everything on. I, you know, without Theo, I don't know how to put this wig on. I really don't. <laughs> and so I'm trying to do flat iron it. I got this stuff called got to be glue. I think I put too much on my head because I had it in my hand, was sticking to my head, <laughs> trying to put the wig on, and then Jeffrey calls. He forgot his belt. And I said, I, it's almost time for the graduation. I gotta go, I'm trying to do this. And he said, I gotta get my belt, you gotta bring it now. So I, I'm trying, I gotta bring his belt to the school, come back in an Uber, trying to get dressed, trying to put on makeup. It, I think I had purple over here and orange <laughs> over here for my eyeshadow. Then I ran out, because you, I didn't want to wear the heels, I ran out with two different shoes in the Uber. <laughs> we had to come back, and, you, and I was just like, it, it was crazy, John, but I finally got to the school, ran, found a seat, and then, you know, you try to sit in a seat where you're gonna be able to see, the cameraman was right in front of me, so I'm doing like, <laughs> I'm doing like that the whole time. But it, it, here's why I just, I couldn't hold it together, because so many of the children, all of them, they said, I wanna thank my mom for being there for me. And, every, and then everybody, 30 kids uh, gave a speech. And I was like, everybody giving a speech? <laughs> but to, to hear the kids thank their mother, and then they came towards the end of the ramp and gave their parents a rose. Aww. And every mother was just bawling because... And I'm not downplaying what the fathers do. You are so amazing, fathers. But I'm just... The, the motherhood. You know your baby graduating and the sacrifices and when... They, you know, and especially... You know you did that. And boys, especially, they, 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 their mother is their safe space. When your kids are testing you and trying to, you know, and talking to you crazy, it's like you're their safe space. Because they won't do it with anybody else but you because you are, you are the place that they can land. And so I was bawling, and we hadn't even got to the H's yet. The last, <laughs> I'm just bawling. So Jeffrey gave his speech, and he gave, he, he, you know, here's the thing. Jeffrey is cutting me off at the knees because he tells me I can't talk about him. And, he, and he's like, don't talk about this, and don't. And I go, that's why I had you, because I got material. <laughs> and at, at this age, it's, when I tell you it was so many funny things, and he was like, you are not to talk about it. But he gave such a wonderful speech, and I'm, I'm bawling, and his daddy was right there behind me, because his daddy <laughs> came. His dad was there, his brother and his sister were there, and uh, I'm just bawling, and his father's bawling, and he had one rose, and he said, and I'm gonna give this rose to my mom and my dad. And I got up, my reading glasses fell off my face. <laughs> I'm bought, my eyelash was hanging halfway on my cheek. And I took, and I, and, and Jeffrey hugged me and I couldn't stop, I just couldn't stop crying. Because I, you know, you remember your kids from when they were little and all of the milestones and the failures and the heartaches and the joy up until this point. And he kept going, Mom, really stop. <laughs> but I gotta tell you, uh, my baby graduated high school and I'm just... <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. I will never forget it. Oh, my... But then after that, I wanted to meet all of the other kids. He was like, okay, you can leave now. I want to introduce my daddy. <laughs> this is what he said. He said, I want to introduce my daddy to everybody. And I was like, yo, dad... Okay, all right. <laughs> So uh, we, we took one picture. I took one picture with, with uh, his father because his father gave me... He gave the rose to his dad and his dad gave it to me. And I took the rose from Jeffrey's dad and I looked at him and I said, don't, OK, don't even think uh, something about to... You know, and nothing going on. This is just me. We got the same kid, but we... Because, you know, I called his dad one time around 2 in the morning. I thought I was calling Jeff free, but I called his son, his father, Jeff, and I said, what you doing? And it was at 2 in the morning. I thought... I think he thinks I still, you know... <laughs> So that's why I'm saying, when he, when he handed me the rose, he looked at me like three seconds too long. I was like, it, no, we not. It just... 
I'm crying because of Jeffrey. But we had a, we had a good time, you know, because I, I tell parents who are splitting, it's all about your child. If you can make it about your child, so we had a great time. So shout out to single mamas. Woo!